In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called solving a word problem involving consecutive integers. So our word problem will include consecutive integers. And here we're told that three consecutive integers have a sum of 264, meaning that they add up to 264. And we're asked to find the integers. So since we have consecutive integers, I'm going to call the first of these integers x and then I know that the second integer would be one more than that so x plus 1 so for example the first one was 4 the second one will be 5 and then the third integer would be x plus 2 so we can see that for consecutive integers each one is just one more than the previous one and since we're told that the sum of these consecutive integers is 264, then I can take the first of these integers, x, add the second integer, which is x plus 1, and add the third integer, which is x plus 2, and that when I add those three integers, I will have 264. And from here, I can add like terms. On the left-hand side, I have three x's, which I can combine as an x plus an x plus an x gives me three x's. And then if I look at the numbers, I also have like terms in the plus one and the plus two. Those I can combine as a plus three still equals the 264 on the right-hand side. I can continue solving this for x. And to isolate that x, I would first want to get the 3x by itself. And I can do so by subtracting this 3 term over to the other side of the equation. That will cancel the 3 on the left-hand side, leaving me with the 3x equals 264 minus 3 would be 261. And then lastly, to find x, I would divide both sides of the equation to isolate the x. This would cancel the threes on the left-hand side, leaving me with just x. And then 261 divided by 3 would give me an 87. So I found x, but the instructions are to find the integers. So the first one, x is 87. The second is 87 plus 1, which is 88. And the third is 87 plus 2, which is 89. Those are our three consecutive integers that add up to 264.